Open is supposed to be faster than closed stance. Open stance being your feet parallel to your hips. Closed stance, one foot in front. That's open. This is open. This. Is so when you go to open, you go to turn and run to the ball. Take giant steps to the ball, little steps at the end, assuming there's time. This time she's just, she's barely gets to this ball. But if you give in time, you want to step in. And that's the big key right here. Here's a load phase right here. Gathering all her weight on that back foot. She's going to step into the court, close stance, and strike the ball. Transfer weight forward right there, push off of the back leg. The compressing, you get down, bring your knee bend. By bringing your knees, by bringing your body weight down, you bring more power to the ball also. You can spring up into it. It's like you're pushing against a wall, get all your weight going forward. The key here is transferring the weight from the back foot to the front foot and having your body turn into the shots with your hips and shoulders being aligned. There's all that weight coming to your front foot. I prefer having that heel off the ground on the front foot because I think you turn into your knee otherwise. And this is where you lose a step if you're close because if you're on the run, you'll see it that you need a, you lost a step there. So you compare this with open, there's that step in coming back right there, see? Now watch, as she hits it open, she's already back. That's what we talk about. Close stance, you lose a step, open, you hit it, and you're already back. Hit it, boom, you're back. There's a close stance again. Now the shot's gone, but watch the feet, right? Because this is closed, that back leg has to come over and she recovers her balance. And the leg has to push off to come back. Whereas when you hit open, that leg is already pushed you off and you're already coming back. That's the extra step we're talking about. So whenever someone hits close, you're going to lose a step coming back. It's really small. But at the higher levels, it makes a big difference. The open stance shot, notice, she'll plant the foot, full stretch, get the shoulder rotation. Because your feet are parallel, you're going to lose some body weight transfer, which is normal. So what you guys see happening on between the open and the closed, the load's smaller, the hip and shoulder is still aligned, but unlike the closed, the weight's not going forward as much because you're not transferring weight from your back foot to your front foot. Your feet are parallel. So it's very difficult to transfer your weight forward. There'll be some weight coming forward right there. And she brings her hips as her hands forward into shot as she rotates her shot. But when you have closed stance, you step in, much more weight transfer right there. There's, she, she's already back with the open stance. The weight transfer is nominal. Very small weight transfer coming forward. But the recovery is there. Whereas if you go closed versus open, I really think closed is better in terms of power, but open is better for recovery. And if you watch the points, you'll see that it's basically they're hitting both, whatever they have opportunity. If you can step in, they'll step in, but if you can't step in, there's no opportunity for you to step in. Thank <laughs> you.